G'day mates, Pocket Dragon here, and to hype things up for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, which I already pre-ordered it, and I'm looking forward to the multiplayer reveal and the beta, we are going to go back and look at Black Ops 3, a game which I'm not really a fan of. Not only does this game have a confusing as fuck story and an amazing zombies mode, However, like before, I'm only going to be covering the multiplayer, because that's what this review is all about. Now, please keep this in mind. What I'm about to say is my own opinion on this game, so please take this with a grain of salt. Everyone has their own, everyone has a right to their own opinion after all. Now, we had a lot of boots on the ground for some time in Call of Duty games. Modern Warfare 1, 2, and 3, Black Ops 1 and 2, and Call of Duty Ghosts. But when Advanced Warfare came along, it decided to shake things up a bit by introducing jetpacks into the mix. Now, I wish I could get footage of Advanced Warfare, but since the servers are practically dead and no one playing it, which is a shame because I liked Advanced Warfare, Black Ops 3 came along and decided to advance the jetpack mechanics with thrusters so you could stay in the air a little bit longer. Now, when I first played this game, I really could not get comfortable with the advanced move mechanics at all. Seriously, trying to track and shoot enemies while they're moving so fast in the air can be extremely frustrating. I wouldn't appreciate it if the advanced movement was optional. Back in Advanced Warfare, you can play the game standard with jetpacks, but you can also play the game the classic way with boots on the ground before they patched it out. But why didn't Black Ops 3 do the same thing? That would have made Black Ops 3 a little bit more enjoyable. Heck, a few years later when Black Ops 4 got released, they brought back boots on the ground, so why didn't Black Ops 3 do that in the first place? I mean, don't get me wrong, jetpacks can be fun at all, but... Playing the game the classic way can be even more fun, you know? Another thing I really do not like when it comes to the multiplayer of this game is how they handle DLC weapons, and they locked it behind loot boxes. Trying to get the DLC weapons is such a pain in the ass. I tried really hard to get my personal favorite weapon, the, the AN-94. Yeah, I tried really hard to get my personal favorite weapon, the AN-94, but no matter how many times I opened those loot boxes, I could not get what I want. I could pretty much waste money, like thousands of dollars, trying to get the damn thing, but I know it's going to be a waste of time and money, so... Yeah. Th heck, there's even a person who wasted thousands upon thousands of dollars trying to get what he won, but the game just said no. I would have liked it if the duplicates you get turn into scrap, and you can spend on that scrap to unlock camos, weapons, and stuff like that, and it will lead up to the, it will lead up to the weapon you're trying to unlock. That would have made the game a lot more fair. They did this for, they did this for Modern Warfare Remastered and World War Two, one of my personal favorite games. I know a lot of people really enjoyed Black Ops 3, but the advanced movement and locking DLC weapons behind loot boxes made me skip this game. I also didn't like the fact that Infinite Warfare copied Black Ops 3's mechanics and put it into its own game, which is why I liked calling Infinite Warfare Black Ops 3 in space. And a lot of people are going to be, uh, and I know a lot of people are going to be asking me, are you going to review Infinite Warfare? No, Infinite Warfare does not deserve a review. It doesn't deserve one. The game would have been so much better if boots on the ground was an optional thing for Black Ops 3. It would have made the game so much fun. And I wish there would have would I wish there was another way to unlock DLC weapons for this game. But with that being said, I'm gonna give Black Ops 3 a 4 out of 10. This is Poke Dragon signing out. Catch you guys later.